Hello everyone. Um, I just thought I'd um, do a quick little video here as um, a couple of my customers were saying they, had, they didn't know how to use the adhesive sheets. So I'm going to do a, a, just a simple card um, to show you how I use it, okay? So I'm going to start with cutting my card base. Make sure everything's okay. I try to do it on Facebook as a live video, but the Wi-Fi is not um, cooperating today. So I'm going to cut this at five and a half, which is half a sheet of the cardstock. And then I'm going to score it at four and a quarter. which is the grey blade. And this is what I do to line up to make sure that I've got it right. Okay, that's the card base. Now I'm going to do some of this DSP. This is from the Hello Friend um, Celebrations Bundle. So I'm going to cut this at five and a quarter by four inches. Okay, so that's oh, that's going to be that's going to be the the front of the card like this. Okay, now what else am I going to do here? Nothing with this. So, what we want to do is, where did I put all my pieces? Here, we're going to use Knight of Navy cardstock. So what you want to do is cut a piece of the size that you want. So I'm going to cut it at, what size is this? Is it three and a quarter? So three and a quarter by, we'll do three and a quarter by four. I'll do three. Three inches by four. Okay, so then we're going to adhere it on here. So um, if you can see here, it has a little, it has a little cut along here. So you're just going to peel this part off. This is the way I do it anyway. And then stick it on your cardstock like this. Then you pull up the other sheet, the other part of it. We'll use my take a pick for this. Okay, then stick that down. So then you've got it on here. But then you're going to turn it over. And let's bring my cut and emboss machine. I'm using the mini cut and emboss machine. And next month, during the month of March, this is going to be 20% off. So keep your eye on that. That's a great deal. So we're using this die. I'll show you in a minute. So we're going to put the die down. Put the other plate in. Sorry if it's going to be a bit shaky. Let me do this. Check it to see if it's gone through. Sometimes you need to go through a few times, but that looks okay. Let's make sure you're okay. In, in, in the shot. Let's put this over here for right now. 
So I'm going to take this off. So I'm using the this set here. Just want to say, and um, let's get. Don't you just? You don't really have to. It's just to get it off the. Usually I use my little brush to get it out, but I'm, I don't want to do that today. I just want just want to say that's what we're doing for this one. So what we're going to do is we're going to get our put it, oh yeah. We're going to put it on here. So on the back. And she, uh, just poke out any little bit so you see it shouldn't be there. Hopefully it will poke out. Oh dear. This piece might not come out, but let's let's get this, get it started. Let's use my little tweezers for this, make it go on. The good thing about this um, silicone mat is it's great for doing stuff like this because nothing sticks to it. I can't get that little pokey bit out. Let me see if I can get it. Oh, there we go. Okay, so I'm just going to put this right here. I just want, I just want, okay, It makes putting, doing the intricate dye so much easier when you use the adhesive sheets. I just want to say, okay, so that's that done. Next, we are going to stamp the saying on here. Uh, where's my saying? I'm doing thank you card. Thanks. And then I'm going to use the double oval punch. decide to do oh no I'm going to do the fresh freesia okay 
Okay. And then we're going to get some ribbon, my scissors, cut some ribbon, okay, I'm going to use this reinker bottle, I'm going to wrap the ribbon around it. just snip it in the middle like so and that's going to go here let's turn it over glue the back let's do it about oh no let's do it You can see the egg. Okay, then I'm going to put it to the, I have to do this standing up. I do a lot of my crafting standing up. pieces. Where did I put them? Where does I put them? Where are they? Oh, there's one. find it in two seconds. Anyway, so then we're going to so high up okay then I'm going to put this here I'm going to cut um, should I do it here yeah I'm going to cut this off a little bit a little bit mm -hmm. and I think I will pop this up on dimensionals Silly me, which one do I like best? I'll do this side. It was stuck underneath the whole time and I didn't even see it. <laughs> Ok, 
okay so oh it's a little bit wonky let's move it a little bit if i can i might stick another one under there because i don't like when it's up like that we go so just a simple card I just wanted to do it to show you how to use the the adhesive sheets this one's a little bit wonky but anyway I hope you liked it and um, it's given you some ideas for make for using your adhesive sheets because they make they make it uh, so much easier especially with the intricate dies Okay, well, thanks a lot for, for watching and um, I hope this helps. Okay, thank you. Bye.